Today on our home quarantine, we decided to do some chalk art. So we are going to prospect the good spot on the driveway and start chalking it up. But it's a nice day, so we're just gonna stay at home, stay safe, and make some art, even though we're not artists. So because we aren't artists, we're going to be using tape. We've seen this on social media. There's been a couple of people that do it. They like use this blue painter's tape and they tape it down so it like forms geometric Shapes triangles and stuff. And, stuff. and then, then you chalk pull over the tape it. Up. Yeah, and so it's it's really cool. So that's what we're gonna be doing today because our artistic abilities are very, very bad. So hopefully this looks cool. We had to take a little break because Eli was getting upset. Now that he's trying to nap, we're gonna get back to it and see if we can finish chalking it up while he's napping. Also, look at these massive pieces of chalk. I went to Walmart to try and buy more colors, but apparently chalking is an exciting thing to do during quarantine, and they were all sold out of chalk. The only chalk that they had left was like a pack of 200, and I didn't want that, so I didn't buy it. It's looking pretty good so far. This is our purple chalk. It started off big and now it's tiny. It's looking pretty good. What do you think? Yeah, looks sweet. Looks sweet. Once we rip the tape off, that'll be the most satisfying part, so stay tuned. I think Eli knows that he's missing out because he's not napping good. He's just crying in there. There's like a couple spots on here where you can tell like the color needs to go there. So I'm going to do yellow in those spots. I'm going to mark it. We don't want two colors of the same color right next to each other. Yeah. So she's kind of planning out tacky. where it goes. So. You always have to sign or leave your signature on your piece of art. So Tessie is going to brand our masterpiece right here and put our names. We are done chalking. I got a gigantic crick in my neck. We were able to chalk it all while Eli was napping. So we got it done, he's still napping. So now for the most satisfying part and the part you've all been waiting for, the ripping up of the tape, which makes it look cool, hopefully. The tape like is like stacked up on top of each other, so it's gonna be tricky. It'll work. Just start somewhere. Pick an end, any end. Look at that line. Oh boy, we got two strands going. What do you think? <laughs> it looks really cool. Looks pretty sweet. So there are, are a lot of new people to this channel. Thank you for joining us. Um, if you don't know why, we are the Cox clan. Riley Cox and Tessie Cox. Yep. And Eli Cox is our little baby. But I think it turned out pretty good. The tape, as you can see, makes it so that the lines are super hard and you can see where they were at, so it looks pretty sweet. I mean, we're not exactly sure how long it took because Eli had a little fit in the middle, <laughs> but I think it was about like an hour-ish or less than. So this is also a fun, cheap activity. The tape was like- I thought it was more fun than actual, like just chalking. Oh yeah, yeah. Cause like you're working towards a goal and like a design at the end. Definitely, yeah. And it's super cheap. The tape was just a couple bucks. Chalk, I'm pretty sure you can get that at like the dollar store. If you have young kids, it might be something that's fun for them to do, so. It survived the next day. It does have a couple tire tracks on it cause Tessie drove on it. <laughs> Anyways. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Hit that big red subscribe button. See ya. See you next time. Say bye, E. Bye.